Good day everyone, welcome to Senior Pablo TV. And for today's tutorial video, we will be discussing measuring length. This will be the first lesson for our grade 7. So, measuring length. These are the things you need to remember. Meter is the basic unit of length in the metric system. The metric system is based on the powers of 10. So we have 10 millimeter that is equal to 1 centimeter. Uh, 10 millimeters is equal to 1 centimeter. And 10 centimeters is equal to 1 decimeter. And 10 decimeter is equal to 1 meter. 1,000 meters is equal to 1 kilometer. To better understand, let's have this metric system. Okay, how to use this? So we have here the kilometer, hectometer, decameter, meter, decimeter, dm, centimeter, the cm, and millimeter, the mm. Kilometer for km, hectometer for hm, and decameter for dam. We're going to use this to easily convert a number to the desired unit. So let's say we have number one. We're going to convert 9.2753 kilometers to centimeters. Notice that we're going, or here at kilometer, we need to convert to centimeters. In our table, the kilometer is located here. That is how many units from the centimeter? So that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 5 units. That means in our decimal point, our decimal point is located here, we need to move 5 times to the right. So move 5 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So we, need, we have an excess here, so we can write that as 9, 2, 7, 5, 3. And we have excess, we will write 0 on that. Understood that our decimal point is located here. It's okay not to write our decimal point because this is a whole number now. So our unit is... C M. Okay. That means 9.2753 kilometers is equal to 927,530 centimeters. Next, number two. 975 centimeters to meters. So, the given unit is centimeters we're going to convert to meters so we know that the decimal point is located here okay so in our table where is the centimeter here going to meter centimeter going to meter we need to move one two so we need to move twice Locate the decimal point, then move twice. One, two, period. That will become 9.75. The third unit is meter. So 975 centimeters is equal to 9.75. Now, number three, 
decimeter to hectometer. So in our table, locate the decimeter. Decimeter going to hectometer. So one, two, three. So from the decimal point, move three times to the left. So one, two, three. Period. So we have excess of two here, so we will write zeros on that. So we have zero point. We will write zero here. Zero. Another zero. Then. Zero, two, one, eight, four, two, one, eight, four. Our des desired unit is tectometer. Okay, that will be our answer. And for the last number, three point four two one four zero four kilometers to millimeters. Kilometers, locate, it's here, then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. We need to move 6 times to the right. From our decimal point, 6 times, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So that will become 3, 4, 2, one four zero four and our unit is millimeter. Okay, that is on how to convert a certain unit to the desired unit. Measuring length. Now you are ready to answer your modules. Thank you for watching Senior Pablo TV and see you in our next lesson, Measuring Mass.